residential real estate in and around Salt Lake City, current trends are awfully familiar for what we typically see seasonally this time of year. So specifically what I mean by that is we've seen declining inventory for quite some time now. And to compare that to previous years, the last several years, basically the first week of November, which is what we saw in late 2023, we see the inventory supply, high water mark for the year. And what was in previous months, a market slowdown really starting to turn where we see inventory levels coming down and demand indicators remaining relatively constant. Now, this last week was the first week in quite some time where we actually saw more inventory than we saw the week before. You probably don't need someone like me to tell you why that is the case. Of course, a lot of the folks that are waiting through the holidays to put their house on the market for very, very good reasons, whether that's market driven or gosh, just not wanting people to come through your home during the holidays, they suddenly jump in right after the new year. First week or two of the year, we see all of that pent up demand supply entering the market. So that is pretty similar to what we're very likely to see in the coming months. The current trends of decreasing inventory, decreasing supply, very likely to continue. Over the last few years, that trend has continued into kicking off the spring market. 2021 and 2022 were very, very unique. Uh, but to take last year as the example, inventory levels decreased habitually week over week with very few exceptions from early November into March. So just for simplicity, think through the end of the first quarter as the spring selling season really kicks off. Last year was one where the spring selling season really started way earlier, like now. <laughs> Very likely that is what we're going to see this year, in the coming months, and in the coming weeks. Do not be surprised if we see the market accelerate, and possibly a lot, in the coming weeks and the coming months. As pent-up demand enters the marketplace to scoop up homes, and there's less of those homes out there. So supply and demand economics, that's very likely what we're going to see. Of course, if you are having thoughts of moving in the next little bit, it's a good time to do so. Mortgage rates are down significantly in the last couple of months. So that is very, very good news. Things that are out of our control, but we love when affordability increases just a little bit. Kind of nice, but we'd love to help you. Um, do feel free to reach out. i excited to hear from you. Thanks so much.